Hello, welcome to Daily News from Ajayat TV. Scholarly meetings of Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Holy Qom, Iran. The house of His Eminence Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in the Holy City of Qom continues to hold its scholarly meetings on a daily basis. These meetings are attended by religious scholars, clerics, and seminarians, as well as the general public. The questions at these meetings revolve around topics on Hajj, the refutation of Qiyas, the meaning of the mysterious letters of the Holy Quran, the timing of ayat prayers, and the virtues of the pilgrimage to the Holy Shrine of Imam Reza, peace be upon him. House of Grand Ayatollah Shurazi hosts Iraqi pilgrimage caravans in Holy Qom, Iran. The House of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in the Holy City of Qom welcomed two Iraqi pilgrimage caravans on last Friday and Saturday. The pilgrimage caravans of Anwar al-Muhammadiyah and lovers of Imam Reza, peace be upon them, attended the scholarly meetings of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi and listened to speeches by members of the Grand Jurist's office. Adam Center holds conference in Holy Kabbalah, Iraq. Adam Center for Defending Rights and Freedoms held a conference titled Sharing Power Away Out of Iraq's Political Crisis. This conference was attended by directors of several research centers and legal activists, as well as academics and members of the press. Jawid Audat, a researcher at Adam Center, hinted that everyone needs to perform their responsibility to facilitate reforms in Iraq's political system. At the end of this conference, he expressed his hopes that the Iraqi authorities would adopt the propositions made at this conference by these experts. Ahlul Bayt Islamic Thought Center holds seminar in Baghdad, Iraq. Ahlul Bayt Islamic Thought Center, the women's department in Baghdad, held a seminar titled Sorrows of Imam Ali, peace be upon him, and Martyrdom of Lady Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her. This seminar was attended by tens of women and activists who mourned the tragedies of Imam Ali after the martyrdom of Lady Fatima Zahra, peace be upon them both. In another part of this seminar, these attendees recited Dua Tawassul and Ziyarat Ashura. Baraka Foundation donates food baskets to needy in Wasit province of Iraq. Baraka Foundation, affiliated with the office of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Wasit province of Iraq, donated dozens of food baskets to needy and impoverished families. These donations were made in compliance to the directives of Grand Ayatollah Shurazi. It is worth noting that Baraka Foundation runs numerous cultural, religious, and charitable programs. Mahdevi Seminary begins new courses in Digar province of Iraq. The Islamic Seminary of Mahdavi, affiliated with the Office of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in the Igar province of Iraq, continues its activities. This seminary is run by the Al Shire TV and holds numerous courses for both men and women. These courses address Islamic beliefs, jurisprudence, and ethics. Manager of Batal al Alghami Center meets Director of Office of Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Basra, Iraq. Sayyid Ahmad Razwi, the manager of the Batal al Alghami Center, visited the office of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Basra, where he met with Sheikh Nazar al-Hassan, the director of the Grand Jurist's office. In this meeting, both sides talked about commemorating the Husseini rituals in the coming months. Director of Imam Hussein TV in Lebanon meets Dean of Al-Mustansari University in Baghdad, Iraq. Hussein Jawad al-Sadiq, the director of Imam Hussein Media Group in Lebanon, met with the dean of the Al-Mustansari University in the Iraqi capital, Baghdad. Dr. Issam Asal Hassan, the dean of the Al-Mustansari University, discussed the important role of media in addressing social, psychological, and educational issues. The director of Imam Hussein Media Group, in his turn, also suggested cooperative projects to produce and broadcast TV programs on various topics. Fatima Zahra Institute installs water coolers in Holy Kabbala, Iraq. Fatima Zahra Institute, affiliated with the office of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Holy Kabbala, installed several water coolers in the vicinity of the shrine of Imam Hussein, peace be upon him. This humanitarian work was conducted in collaboration with the orders of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi. It is worth noting that in recent days, this institution announced the construction of a charitable complex which will provide orphans and impoverished families with residence and educational facilities. Imam Sadiq Institute holds conference in Basra, Iraq. Imam Sadiq Institute, affiliated with the office of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Basra, held a conference titled Youth and Culture. This conference was attended by groups of young activists who listened to the director of the Grand Jurist's office in this city, Sheikh Nazar al-Hassan. 
the inclusion of youth in cultural and religious programs, and fostering the talents of the younger generations were discussed in this meeting. Director of Faisal Batul Institute meets Iraqi tribal chiefs in Nasiriyah. Sheikh Hastawi, the director of the Faisal Batul Institute, affiliated with the office of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Sogoshiyuk, city of Iraq, met with groups of Iraqi tribal chiefs. In this meeting, which took part in the Nasiriyah city of Iraq, the discussions were focused on the strong ties between Iraq's tribal communities and the religious leadership. Commemorations of Lady Fatima, peace be upon her, at 14 Infallible Institute in Holy Karbala, Iraq. Servants of Ahlul Bayt Center, affiliated with the office of the Grand Ayatollah Shurazi in Holy Karbala, held a ceremony to mourn the martyrdom of Lady Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her, at the headquarters of 14 Infallible Institute. Tens of believers and cultural activists attended this ceremony and mourned this occasion. <laughs>